It's possible that you don't fully understand how our planet comes to our rescue. Our planet's special characteristics shield us against threats that would otherwise be lethal. However, once you leave Earth, all bets are off, and the further you travel into space, the more terrifying the creatures you encounter become. Wormholes are just one of many fascinating features of the universe's depths. After years of study, scientists have identified the first wormhole with the help of the James Webb Space Telescope, whose observations have already blown our minds. They're presently expanding Webb's findings into a new dimension. Wormholes are both interesting and terrifying because of their almost infinite potential for transporting. Scientists have found wormholes fascinating, and some have even managed to make their own. Don't go until you discover how scientists plan to prove wormholes exist. The James Webb Space Telescope appears to have captured an image of a wormhole whirling through the ghost galaxy, an area where a black hole may lurk. Images captured by NASA's most recent Deep Space Telescope continue to astound professional and amateur astronomers alike. Judy Schmidt, who transformed NASA's raw data into a breathtaking image of the ghost galaxy, told Space.com, I've been doing it for 10 years and the data is new, unusual, and intriguing. For $10 billion, the James Webb Telescope is six times more powerful than its predecessor, the Hubble Telescope and new data has led researchers at the University of Manchester to speculate that there may have been 10 times as many galaxies like our own in the early universe as we previously thought. Despite their frequent appearance in science fiction, wormholes have remained a theoretical concept for quite some time. This is due to the fact that in 1935, the great scientists Albert Einstein and Nathan Rosen found the simplest possible wormhole solution by starting with the mathematical solution of a black hole, another terrifying phenomenon consisting of a singularity, or point of infinite density, and an event horizon, beyond which no object can escape. For every black hole, Einstein and Rosen discovered there is a white hole somewhere else in the universe. And since these holes are in different parts of space, a tunnel would connect their two ends. However, the existence of this tunnel, known as a wormhole, posed a threat to stability because even a single photon, or particle of light, traveling through the wormhole would introduce a tremendous amount of energy into the system, and you'll be trapped in the wormhole forever. But scientists have recently discovered how to create a wormhole that is both stable and traversable, so there is hope that you can escape with just a few simple equations. Scientists have found that you need exotic matter, or some kind of matter, with negative mass, to stabilize a wormhole, a technique discovered in the 1970s, such that passing through it does not cause instant catastrophic collapse. Negative mass is an intriguing idea because, for example, if you set an object with negative mass alongside a positive one, then the positive thing will move away from the negative object swiftly quicken in speed without the use of any external power source. Exotic stuff is distinct from dark matter and antimatter, and there's also the issue of size. While wormholes are thought to have formed at the tiny level of around 10 to 33 centimeters during the Big Bang, some may have stretched out to enormous sizes as the universe expanded. Scientists have stated that the experience would be peculiar, with the wormhole's entrance seeming like the spherical surface of a planet and light streaming in from the other side as you travel down the wormhole's tunnel, which can be infinite in length. Wormholes can also make a familiar concept in science fiction come to life. Have you ever wondered how time machines work? Moving clocks operate slowly, according to special relativity. Thus, a person traveling at the speed of light would not move in time relative to a stationary observer as quickly as the two would be initially synchronized. You can go back in time by creating a wormhole, then accelerating one end to nearly the speed of light, causing it to lag behind the other entrance. Then you can bring the two entrances together, but one of them will be in the past of the other. When you emerge from the wormhole, you'll feel as though you've just experienced a moment from your past all over again. This is how scientists are trying to create a wormhole in a laboratory, and we have no idea if we should be alarmed by their efforts or not. 
Researchers at Spain's University of Barcelona have built a sphere that can move a magnetic field from one location to another. They credit the theoretical work of mathematics professor Alan Greenleaf at their institution for the success of their project. Rochester, New York, where he developed the hypothesis of an electromagnetic wormhole that might carry electromagnetic waves between locations without their physical presence. It was problematic creating the device because the materials needed to create it were impractical and difficult to work with, but they did already exist, which made it possible to test Greenleaf's theory. The Spanish team used magnetic metamaterials and metasurfaces to create a wormhole that transfers the magnetic field in space from one point to the other through a magnetically undetectable path. It took the team four months to build the wormhole after they confirmed the design. But the result is that a magnetic field appears to travel from one point to the other via a dimension that lies outside the conventional three dimensions. One of the researchers, Julie Pratt Camps, said that after extensive research, they understood that Greenleaf's concept could work. With a ferromagnetic outer layer, an interior layer of superconducting material, and an outer ferromagnetic sheet folded into a cylinder that cuts across the middle, from one extreme to the other. The sphere is designed to be magnetically invisible and undetectable. The magnetic wormhole is analogous to gravitational wormholes in that it alters the topology of space, making it appear as though the inner region has been magnetically erased. However, the most intriguing aspect of the Spanish team's innovation is that it has a practical application. Magnetic fields are frequently employed in the medical area, but the wormhole they have built is a three-dimensional gadget that cannot be detected by any magnetic field. This device has the potential to improve the MRI scanning experience for patients by allowing them to move away from the detectors, thereby reducing anxiety. The Russian astronomers suggest that wormholes might exist in the centers of some very brilliant galaxies and propose some observations to detect them. But many scientists are still striving to uncover the truth to verify their existence. May occur if material escaped from one side of the wormhole and collided with other material escaping from the other side. Matter collapsing, as predicted by the calculations, would produce a spectacular gamma ray burst, which we could try to view with telescopes. These radiations can aid in the detection of the collision. The difference between a wormhole and a black hole, previously thought to be indistinguishable to an outside viewer, can be seen in the amount of radiation emitted by each object, constrained to a very large sphere. Share your thoughts with us on the wormhole hypothesis. Thanks for watching this video until the end. Like this video and subscribe to our channel to stay updated about the latest space news, James Webb Space Telescope updates, and other news. We have another incredible video ready for you. Click on the video on your screen and let us take you into another interesting space story.